guys, today's video is sponsored by the OneFootball app. If you haven't done it already, head down to the description before this video starts, click the link and download it completely free of charge on iOS or Android. Hello boys and girls, how you doing? Welcome back to another video. I've got something slightly different for you today, which I think you're actually going to enjoy quite a bit. So, um, I actually sat down with Christian Billick and Chris Maxwell to film a exclusive sponsored video for BetDAC, which is now up on Charlton's Twitter, on BetDAC's Twitter, and of course on Charlton's YouTube channel. So first and foremost, that uh, video will be linked down in the description. So after you've uh, finished watching this video, make sure you go down to the description and you will find the link to go and watch that one. It, it was a lot of fun and uh, I think hopefully you lot will enjoy it. Uh, now, what I have to say about that video and filming it is that it didn't quite get edited in the way that I fully intended when I first sat down and filmed with them and then, you know, produced the first draft of the video. I got a little bit of feedback and I was told that there was a certain part of the video that, that wasn't quite right for the for the sponsored um, video that went up on BetDAC and Charlton's channels. So I'm actually going to share that content with you as a little bit of a behind the scenes because I personally think that it was it was it was quite funny and it was a, it was a good little uh, segment of the video. So um, I'm about to spoil the video, right? So if you want to pause this one right now, I suggest you pause this one, go and open the other video in a new tab watch that and then come back and resume uh, this video. I'm gonna allow you some time to do that now because spoiler is coming in three, two, one. Okay, so hopefully you've watched the video now and you will know that it finished in a draw between Billick and Maxwell. Now, there was another question that got missed out because it was a question that wasn't quite right for the other video. It was a personal question. And if I'm allowed, I will post that right now. So this is one that's just gonna be a complete shot in the dark for you boys, this, this last question. So, to the nearest thousand, how many subscribers do I have on my YouTube channel? A, 1,000, B, 2,000, or C, 3,000? Is this on your YouTube channel? Uh, this won't go on there. I might plug it, but it won't go on there. You've got a YouTube channel, yeah? To the nearest thousand. Nearest thousand. 1,000, 2,000, 3,000. Two. 2,000. Three. He's done it. He's done it. Oh, he said three. Oh, that's wrong, Kevin. Correct. That's a no, sorry, we, we have a question for you. We have a question for you as oh, well. Hold on. <laughs> I thought you got to get this right. right. That you thought that was a so head to head. I, I, no, I, no, I pulled no. ahead here. Yeah, he pulled, pulled ahead, and now it's and now it's Christian's turn to try and equalise. Okay. The tables have turned. To the nearest one, how many nieces and nephews do I have? You. Yep. Person. What kind of questions is that? <laughs> we have I one that I just we have no idea. Me. I know you since 10 minutes. <laughs> <laughs> How long have I known him? He, he had no idea and now you have no idea, so it's fair. It's fair. So, A2, B3 or C4? The second question was... <laughs> 2, 3 or 4? Four. 4. Come on, Chris. He's done it. <laughs> He's done it. Ridiculous. He's done it. He was looking at you. He's only done it. <laughs> then it was still a draw situation, even after that question, right? So then after that, I decided to play a little game with Billick and Maxwell, and um, it was it was it was certainly interesting. So here you go. Here is the exclusive content of Christian Billick and Chris Maxwell playing Splat. They're in Europa League, mate. Yes. Wrong. So, 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 right. we, so you both lose, you both on zero points, which means there's only one way to settle this, so we actually find the winner. You know what that is, don't you? Tiebreak. No, this game is Splat. What's oh, okay. You ever played Splat? The rules of Splat are as follows. I'm going to read out a made-up story containing many words beginning with the letters SP. The only way to win is to be the fastest person to turn around and Splat the other player Mm. with your paintball gun as soon as you hear the word splat. It's the ultimate test of reflexes. Okay, ladies and gents, these gentlemen are both equipped with paintball guns right now, and they are playing a game of splat. So I'm going to tell the story, and we're going to see who is the ultimate champion and who is the most intelligent out of Chris Maxwell and Christian Billick. Gents, listen up. It was a very spooky night. Yep, little step. I had just finished, wa finished watching the Sporting Lisbon game and I was having a splendid time. I'm sitting on the sofa and out the corner of my eye, I see a sparkle. It made me jump, but false alarm. It was just my phone. A notification reminded me to head to betdac.com 
and spend a couple of quid on the dogs. As I reached for my phone, I knocked over a glass of water on the table next to me and spilt it. What's wrong with you, me? <laughs> of course, now I had to go and get the sponge and clean it up. Splat! Oh, that's Chris. That is a victory for Christian Billick right there. That is reactions from Christian Billick. Congratulations, sir. You are the champion. Right, so I hope you enjoyed that. And Christian Billick, certainly very, very sharp with the old splatter. So other than that, guys, I know there hasn't been a red roundup for a while. I um, haven't been to any away games and stuff like that recently. So um, it looks increasingly like the next vlog edition, at least, of the red roundup will be when we inevitably make the playoffs and it should be the away fixture of the semi-final. Because uh, let's be honest, it looks like we are going to get at least sixth place uh, so far this season. So uh, hopefully that should be very, very fun in, in a few weeks' time. That'll be probably in mid-May, I suppose. Uh, but yeah, that will be the next Red Roundup. And then the other thing that I want to say, I'm actually thinking about launching or relaunching, because I had this a while ago, uh, my gaming... Oh, I've just had a, I've just had an idea. I could call my gaming channel Gamey Boxel. Unbelievable. Um, I used to actually put games on this channel, but I don't really do that anymore other than FIFA. Um, so first question, and this is one for the comments, because I've got... A, in fact, I've got a few questions here. First of all, would you want FIFA to be on this channel, like the FIFA series, or my gaming channel? Because I know this is quite football-y, so I think FIFA does belong here, but I just want to know what you think. So that's the first question. Second question, would you be interested in subscribing and watching videos of games like, I don't know, GTA, Spyro, Fortnite? I don't know why I put Spyro in the middle. That's a re really random one. But, you know, just like playthroughs and walkthroughs, just a really chill sort of half an hour sort of gameplay video. Would you be interested in that? Let me know if you would be. Anyway, guys, that is going to be it for this video. Please do leave a like on it please do subscribe to the channel if you are new hope you enjoyed and i'll see you next time sweet